Welcome to the Legend of Zelda Orcarina of Time. You may or may not know this, but as cliched as it is, this is my favorite video game of all time. In the list of my top three video games, it's Orcarina of Time, Sega Genesis Gunstar Heroes, and Sonic 3 and Knuckles. And so, I'm gonna do a 100% playthrough of this game, as deep and delving in as deep as I can, um, and it's probably gonna be hell and torture on Earth. Uh, Super Mario 64 should be done by now, and oh my god, it was it crazy. But that's the way we do. So let's delete this. I don't want this shit. I don't know. I don't even. I don't even know. Okay. We we'll come up with a name here. Let me think. <clears throat> um, first, first, first. Uh, post in the comments is the name I'm gonna choose. You got five seconds. Okay, I like that one. That, that was a good name. I I think we can do that. So don't 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 blame um, me for this name. I didn't choose it. The first commenter did. Just keep that in mind. So, you know, this is the name. Thanks to. Whoever that first commenter is. Thank you, good sir. Thank you. We are now barfed in. Let's start this thing. <clears throat> I don't know if you can hear me shifting around my chair. I'm just trying to get comfortable. Ooh, dialogue. In the vast, deep forest of Hyrule, long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. I'm going to try to make him British, actually. Let's do a little Britishness here. The children of the forest, the Kokiri, live here with me. Ooh. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. Look at him. Did. Oh my god, he sleeps with his eyes open! However, there is only one boy who does not have a fairy. And he sleeps like Donald Duck. With his eyes open, baby. He even has a blink cycle there. What's what is that? That or he just doesn't sleep. Oh, look at this. We're seeing a little bit of uh, foreshadowing here. Something, some, something important seems to be to show one up here. It looks like. Yes. Uh, I want to say I'm not the most informative let's player. I don't know everything about every game. I don't do my research. I'm not quite the Game Grumps, but I'm not quite the Great Clement either. But for this game, I know my shit. I know a lot of stuff. So if whenever I come across something interesting, a little tidbit, a little trivia, whatever, maybe I'll do my best to try and point it out to y'all. Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. And don't worry, we're gonna have some fun with Navi. Oh. Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Deco Tree. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent forces even now, excuse me, are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. Ever so long, the Kokiri forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders, and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy who sleeps with his eyes open to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi! Go now! Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly! The fate of the forest, nay, the world, depends on thee! Ah. Uh, in my Super Mario playthrough, I had to edit out a lot of sniffling. But I'm gonna try my darndest to not sniffle as much in this playthrough. That was the reason why there was a lot of blank, you know, points there. 
Navi 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 I'm a fairy 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 and look at me fly around in the place I'm gonna look around and out of the space I don't make sense I don't know I'm going I'm a fairy I'm a fairy I'm a fairy I'm blowing I'm a fairy I'm a fairy I'm a Navi I'm a fairy I'm a fairy I hit the fence I think I know where to go right now I'm a fairy 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 Hit, 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 hit. Let's go to the, this this little dunce. This just ugh, look at him. He's sleeping with his eyes open. It's crazy kid. Hello, Austin. Wake up. Was that good? Was that was that annoying enough for Navi? The crazy Gucci wants to talk to you. Austin, get up. It's gonna be a lot of that. I'll get used to it. Hey! Come on! Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Ah, Navi. You are truly the greatest little stupid companion, Daish. Uh, you woke me from my nap! Couldn't you tell I was sleeping? to be your partner from now on! So get used to it! Oh, and nice to meet you. The Great Deku Tree has summoned you! Let's get going right now! Oh, I don't think I'm gonna like this. Well, what with this being old school games? I guess, still a thing of the old school. We have a little secret tidbit information factoid. Right up the get go, in the first room, it's the first place! If you notice, if I go over here, empty space, moving around. Go over here, empty space, moving around. Here, moving around. I'll just go to this one and, oh, what the hell? What is, I'm just, I'm just, I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, what? What is this? Now you may notice why is he hitting an invisible wall? There's actually supposed to be two pots here that you actually can't see. In fact, there's another point. I think it's pots. There's another point in the game too where you're gonna see that. It's in this. In this. It's actually in this village. In this forest. Uh, and I'll point that out too when we get to it. I don't know how. I forget the reason why that occurs, but it, you know, whatever. Yahoo! Hi, Barfton. Another thing you know about the cookery cork is they don't age, so they may look like seven, but they're really like three thousand and twelve. Uh, they're probably like sixty, fifty, whatever, but they don't age. And already another little piece of information, another bit of foreshadowing. Right here is a telling, uh, a foreshadowing of a uh, little drawing of the final event in the game, fighting Ganon. That's Navi. That's Link. That's little bitty Ganon. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah. Okay. What did this say? What what did you saying? Target you. Barfton's house. Wow! A fairy! Finally a fairy came to you, Barfton! Wow! That's great news! I'm so happy for you! Jeez, everything with those exclamation points. Now you're a true Kokiri Barfton! Is that right? The Great Deku Tree has summoned you? It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Deku Tree! Okay, just sh sh Have you ever heard of a period, Saria? Jeez. I'll wait for you here! Oh my god, look, she used the period! Get going! Go see the Great Deku Tree! I've never noticed it before, but this girl really doesn't know how to use- Oh, great. The Great Deku Tree is summoned you! Please come with me! No. <laughs> I've never noticed, but she really doesn't know how to use periods. Everything with her is yelling. <laughs> she's like the most- She's gotta be the most ecstatic person in the world. She's like, OH MY GOD, BOTHAN! OH MY GOD, YOU GOT A FAY! She's, she's probably like, uh, Kelly on, um, The Office. 
That's what sorry it must sound like. So we need to we need a uh, we need to do a little something here. First we're gonna just gonna, gonna get on here. Go there. The go lay there. Yeah five boobie! Five five boobie got my five boobie got my five five boobie. Five boobie yeah. I'm just gonna go see the dick what does he want? Excuse me. If, if I could just if if, if if I could if I could just if I could just! What do you want? Are you Mr. No Fairy? What's your business with the Great Dicker Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man! What? You got a fairy? Say what? The Great Dicker Tree has actually summoned you? I regret this voice already. What? Why would he summon you, and not the Great Mido? Interesting factoid secret of glitchy thing, whatever it is again. Uh, Mido is a name that is used very often in this Zelda series. It may have started in this game, I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure every game forth uh, after <laughs> uses the name Mido. I don't know why. This isn't funny! I don't believe it! You aren't even fully equipped yet! How do you think you're going to help the Great Digger Tree without both the sword and shield ready? What? You're right. I don't have my equipment ready, but... If you want to pass through here, you need at least equipped a sword and shield. Sheesh! You know, for a, little, for a young looking guy, you have the weirdest voice. Uh, you sound also like you may have a little touch of laryngitis there. You should really get that shell. You know. But fine. I'll get a sword and shield. And then I'll prove to you that I am a real man who's actually an eight year old child. <laughs> but I may be a real man later on. Spoilers. What is this? Why can't I grab it? I want. I want to. I want to grab it, but I can't. Look at me! Look at this tunnel! It's so fun! Wee hee! Oh yeah! Ooh! I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, just gonna take a little, a little piss there. Oh yeah! Oh! Okay, am I tell you taking a piss or you're wanking? What's going on there? Uh, uh, that's better. Yeah, that was a quick pee, wasn't it? Now, what do we have over here? <laughs> You're dead, dead. You got a useless sword that will ditch as soon as possible. You got the cookery sword. On the equipment subscreen, select it with the cursor and equip it with A. This is a hidden treasure of the Kokiri, but you can borrow it for a while. Be sure to practice with it before you really fight. I ain't giving this shit back! What do you think you tell me to do box? You can't tell me what to do box! Stupid box, you're just a box! Yeah, you try and get this shield, we'll see what happens. Yeah, I got it! I got the shield. I've got the shield now. So I'm gonna cut this. Okay, pee bush. Nobody can ever know I peed here. Okay, good. That's right. <laughs> now I just need to get some more rupees. So I can get myself a shield. So I'm just gonna cut this rock. Excuse me just a second. What? Come on. What do you mean I can't cut a rock? What kind of game is it that you can't cut rocks open? Stupid game. Who designed you? What do you want? You loser. You don't even have a name. Hey, let's work on some moves! To jump sideways while L targeting, press A as you move right or left. To do a backflip while L targeting, Press A as you move backwards! To do a wall attack while L targeting! 
Press A as you move forward. While you roll, you can avoid damage. If you have your sword ready while L targeting, you can do a jump attack by pressing A. A jump attack does double damage. You can use L targeting on the stone next to me. So let's practice. Man, he loves his L targeting, huh? What if, what if I'm playing on, um, on a Nintendo? No, I guess they all use L. You win this round, L targeting man. You know, L targeter. He just really doesn't get enough love in this game. You know, people just just overlook him all too often. You know, no love for the L targeter. I swear. <laughs> Yes, yeah, push it out! Oh, 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 I want over this! I want over this! Yahoo! I can do it! Is this the last game that lets you do those kinds of jumps? Those are fun. And they let you go over certain things. I can't... I can't... Alright, right, we're gonna end this video just as soon as I go into this little house here. I think this may be the one with the thing... Uh, is this the one? No, it's not. This is like the brothers or whatever, though. I'm taking this! And I'm taking this! No! No! It's in the roof now. There is no hope. I will mull over this, and I will see you in the next episode.